So I'm Scott Mitchell and I am the director of the Orange Coast College Planetarium. Uh, so the Planetarium is kind of our uh, gift back to the community. We really wanted to have a space on campus where we could bring in people from outside, families, elementary schools, high schools, uh, anybody that wanted to come and you know, experience OCC and what better place than a planetarium where you, it's an educational experience, uh, but it's really, really uh, fun and exciting for them. Uh, they learn, they're uh, you know, interested, uh, and we help them you know, explore and hopefully inspire uh, people to uh, come back to OCC, visit us again, consider us uh, as a you know, college uh, option after high school, uh, or even to pursue a, a love of astronomy for a, a career even. So the bulk of the funding for the planetarium came from the Measure M uh, bond a couple of years ago, which was $20 million that we used towards the planetarium. Uh, and then on top of that, we've had many, many donations from faculty, from just community members, uh, all over the place. And in total, I think we're up to probably $25 million. So the kind of two permanent exhibits are the Science on a Sphere, which can show really whatever you want projected on a ball. Uh, I can show real-time weather, I can show uh, earthquakes, uh, the age of the seafloor, and then I can turn it into silly things like basketballs and eyeballs and you know, fun stuff too. Um, and of course the focal pendulum demonstrates the rotation of the Earth, and that kind of just swings. Uh, it's you know, people have been really, really interested in it. Uh, at any given time when we've had a bunch of people in the building, most of them are crowded around the pendulum. Uh, the planetarium, those projectors are very, very special. The huge, huge 4K laser projectors. And there's six of them that are pointed at different sections of the dome, and we have to go through a whole process to align them and calibrate them, uh, blend the edges of the, the projector fields together so we get one uniform image across the whole dome. And I think it's, uh, it looks really, really good in there when we get it up and running. So.